Hello there. Do you realize that I'm floating right now? This is a new glitch that occurred recently. The interesting part is, we can use this glitch in fire and water trials. Do you want to know how it works? Come follow me. Go to the Cave of Prophecies to do the trial of fire as usual. As you can see, I'm not using glitches at the moment, so I can still light candles or whatever I need to do down here. If you use the floating glitch earlier, it will be hard for you to reach the candle to light it. Do the trial as usual. As you know, trials have become increasingly difficult lately. Maybe this discovery can help a little. I'll show you my journey from the beginning. For those of you who aren't familiar with doing the trial of fire, this is the first checkpoint. Checkpoint 2 Checkpoint 3 Checkpoint 4, which is very legendary. Let's start with this very famous shortcut. You can watch a tutorial on how I do this jump in my previous video about the fire trial. At this point, keep the distance from the wall. Move your left console forward, and spamming jump. Here we come. The most legendary area of all the fire trial shortcuts. They make this part very difficult now. Let's use the new method. Once you reach this area, hit the home map. Go grab your snowboard, just like the one I'm carrying. This snowboard was obtained during the Days of Feast event. After bringing it, go to the aviary map. Follow me. Go to this shop. Prepare your snowboard here, then use it to skate towards the exit. Make sure you slide on your board on your way out. This is what happens. I'm floating. The next step we have to do is Head this way, follow me. Sit at the shrine. It's not easy to sit floating like this. It's not working. You can do it this way. Flap your cape once, and you will touch the ground when you go down. And then tap the sit icon. You will return to the checkpoint from the last time you were on the trial in a floating condition. Now, 
Let's complete this fire test using snowboard glitch. Aim and play the console as in the video, improvise needed. Do it calmly, no need to rush. There you go. Now, all you have to do is finish the rest. Let's go. This is it. We did it. It will be easier to bring a friend. I will show the video how to do a trial of fire with a friend, using snowboard glitch. Stay tuned. Prepare your snowboard at home. Then enter randomly into a realm. Make sure you slide on the snowboard when entering the realm. You will float like this. Go back home after that. You still floating when you're home. Now, you are ready to go to the trial together with your friends, using the snowboard glitch. Let's play with them for a moment her. All right, let's go. See you around, guys. Let's go to trial. Your friends can help you with burning candles and other work that needs to be done down there while you're floating. Follow our journey to complete the trial of fire using a snowboard glitch. It doesn't seem like I'm floating, but I'm floating right now. As you know, we don't need to light the candles if we carry a friend like this. The white candle give us energy. This is the checkpoint 3. We can do shortcuts here with friends. Watch me. It would be easier to use snowboard glitch. For those of you who aren't familiar with this shortcut, look where I went, so you don't get lost later. I swiped the left console repeatedly here, so I could climb up. Stay calm when doing this trick. Don't be afraid of falling. Slowly, but sure. Do this part same as the previous solo video. Yeah, we made it. Trial of Fire complete. 
Now, I will show video footage of me doing a trial of water using this glitch. Stay tuned. That's the video this time. Hopefully, it's useful for you. See you on next video.